Hi guys, in this video I will be talking about website organization and layout and design. So often when I'm evaluating a website, I come across a website like this. It contains all of the required elements, but there is no rhyme or reason to why certain elements are placed in certain places. Um, this is a very short, simple website, but you could imagine a much more complicated website with much more information uh, being completely unnavigatable uh, just because you have no idea where to look for certain information. So organization and layout matters with web design. If your website is impossible to follow, people who come to your website won't find the right information and they'll probably leave and try somewhere else. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to talk about is title. So I have a a simple one, my website. I'm going to place that up into the header and I'm going to center it. Oh, I saw it there. Okay, so I know my title is centered um, because I see that pink alignment uh, line that goes through my entire website. That means it's perfectly centered in the middle of my website. Okay, pictures. So it's more than just having. Um, and pictures on your website. Some of my assignments ask for yeah, maybe five pictures. I want pictures to be all approximately scaled to the same size and aligned and similarly. So you see here I have a small picture of skiers and a larger one of a cat. I want um, these, webs uh, these pictures to be approximately at the same level and the same size. So I'm going to drag my smaller ski picture up to the same top level as that cat picture. And then I'm going to scale it until it matches the same size. And you can tell it's the same size horizontally, or sorry, vertically, uh, when you see that pink vertical line appear to each of the pictures. So I like to often have, again, kind of maybe like a row of pictures or maybe a column of pictures all scaled the same size, not scattered about my website. Okay, buttons. Okay, so I have two hyperlink buttons here. And kind of like, again, I moved one originally, but I still like to always have them centered underneath something and then centered horizontally. So again, I have them underneath each picture, again, centered with the and centered horizontally, so they're on the same line. Um, I also don't like to have competing designs. Like I have a simple rectangular uh, button here and one of those 3D ones that um, look like they're being pressed down when you click on them. Uh, it's better to have the same format. So you could either make them both that uh, 3D look or both that simple 2D look. I'm gonna think I'm gonna change this one to a simple 2D. So I'm gonna click this one, choose the design button and then choose that first theme. So just to make them the same, more uniform. Okay, with my table, again, I would like it to be centered and watch for that pink line to know it's centered. And the same thing with my YouTube video. Just going to save that. So this is what I mean by a more organized, thoughtful uh, website. I don't want what's called the shotgun approach, just where you scatter things about the website just to meet the criteria of what I asked for. I want thought uh, to go into how it's designed and how it's laid out. And a simple vertical look like this one is okay by me. It's simple, it's easy to follow. You're not going to be confused of where to look for information. If you have any questions, Google Classroom or email me. Have a good day.